planet is this one? Ugh, I'm so confused. It's not confusing at all. Huh? I'd be happy to help. I am an outer space expert after all. This is the sun. Mercury's the next one. Then it's Venus and the Earth. That's our home for what it's worth. This red one's large. I'm sorry. The Euro Space Center is closed today. Good to see you. Hi, I'm spaceship model Rick. Hi, Rick. I'm Emma. Mm, I really need to learn about the solar system for a class project. Daddy was so looking forward to visiting, too. If we can't visit the museum, I know who we can call. Hi, Sky. I'm ready for a World Guardian mission. There's a call coming in from Transine, Belgium. Hello, I'm Emma. The space center here is closed, but I need to learn about the solar system. Gee, now I'd fly her into space to see the planets if I was a real rocket. That's actually a good idea. We can make that happen. Uh, really? You bet you sure we can. Thank you, and see you soon. Bye. <laughs> Tensine is a town in Belgium and home to a space center. It's a place that teaches people about space. Helping Emma learn about all the planets of the solar system is way World Guardian worthy. Now, let's get the package ready. Super Pets Power Up Package Printer! Yay! Going to outer space? We sure are, Dad. Just as soon as Jack gets here with Package my package delivery. I'm Jet. On time, every time. Welcome to Belgium, Jet. This here is my dad. This is for you. This is a dream come true! You look mooey, Rick! Mooey means beautiful in Belgium, the language we speak. Mooey! Now let's blast off! Yay! Wow! So amazing! It's awesome! Now let's blast off! Around the solar system? I'll guide you. Oh, this is so great. Our first stop is the sun. Wow, it's so big. And boy, is it bright. Yep, it's a star, the biggest and brightest object in the solar system. Wow, and boy, is it hot. Huh? What is that great big black patch? That's a sunspot. 
It's a phenomenon on this star, and when they happen, the temperature on that part of the sun drops. It really is way too hot. My crayons are starting to melt. I'll cool it down. Thanks so much, Jet. There. The first part of my project is done. Then it's time to head to... Mercury! Mercury is the smallest planet in the solar system. It's the closest to the sun. Wow! It's so close to the sun, everything's dried up. The gravity's less than on Earth, so everything here weighs much less. Really? That means I can jump way higher here. Whoa! Yeah! Awesome bouncing! <laughs> Your coloring of Mercury looks spooey, Emma. Thank you, Jet. Now, Venus! The atmosphere of Venus has a yellow gas in it called sulfuric acid. That's what makes it shine yellow. Wow! <laughs> huh? Wait, I'm hardly rising! Why does the air here feel so much heavier than on Earth? It's because of the greenhouse effect. The heavy clouds keep all the heat in. Oh, so that's the reason why I feel so slow and heavy, right? But that doesn't mean we can't have lots of fun here! Isn't that right? Moving slow! We really are, aren't we? We're in slow motion! It's so really. <laughs> Venus is done! What pretty planet is next, Rick? It's Earth! Yes! yes. Let's go! What's all this stuff floating around out here, Rick? It's space junk. Old satellites and parts of rockets. Uh-oh! Look out! Huh? What? Oh no! Now we're all tangled in this net! What are you doing in space? I was just trying to clean up the space junk. The more we struggle, the more tangled we get. How are we going to get out of here? I know how. It's guardian time. We're guardian Can't even see the earth through it. Hey! It would look nice out here if we changed all the junk into pretty twinkling stars. So we're thinking, Emma. We'll upcycle this junk. Let's all go get it. Power up! We're up, guys! Ready? 
Recycling Space Junk! There! That's Earth all colored in! Thanks for helping clean up the space junk! I'll also help you with your school project, Emma! <laughs> Next stop is Mars, which is covered in beautiful red rocks. Everyone, let's go! Here! Here! Subscribe to our channel!